thing on our Alpha Giulietta that's always bugged me. This is the previous owner, ripped the mirror off and fixed it with just some like wood screws. So uh, I got a replacement. We'll get that on. That will finish up the car nicely. So it's a bit windy today, so we'll try to get mostly filming in here. I've got my Amazon quality trim tools that are like butter and we'll see what we happens. I'm gonna pop this off and have a look at the bolt underneath. So we'll just get in here. I think it's only two little clips, yeah. Easy, you don't even need the trim tool. You can do that with your, you just pull it and take that off. Two little clips, put that aside. And looks like we got a bolt there. We'll have a look at our new mirror. And the new mirror looks like Better unwrap it. So we're gonna have to take the door card off because there's another bolt just down here and another bolt uh, about here. So that's okay. These door cards aren't that hard to take off. I'm not even gonna do a video on it. There's about six videos on YouTube on it. Um, so you can have a look and see how the other guys take them off. It's just a bunch of little screws and it just lifts up. only takes a minute lots of instructions on the internet on how to take the door panel off but uh, the, some of the clips broke but most of them came away pretty good I would recommend using a magnetized bit to pull the screws of the holes but anyway that's another thing okay so this is the cable for the mirror and we got three eight mil bolts so we will take these three out Leave that last one in finger tight, just so it doesn't drop on the ground. Okay, don't drop, don't drop, don't drop. We'll have to use two hands for this. It's just a little, well, was a little plastic uh, locating pin there, but that's, uh, that's gone. Okay, old mirror is out. We can get the new one in. We'll get a bolt ready. Go some wiggling and pushing. That's in. Get that little peg around that. Pop that out with a trim tool. We'll just get one in there to hold it for now. That's 
just in the plastic so we don't need to be super tight there. Okay, that was gonna hold it and we'll start putting the rest of those bits back in and get the little trim things connected. We started it up and tested it. All the wiring's fine, it works. The other one didn't work because uh, it was all, uh, obviously it was torn off and all the wires were a bit of a mess. So uh, we can go back to putting the door card on. And that was a very easy job to, uh, yeah, fix up the exterior. One more little dot job off this card done. Okay, I've had to take everything back off because when I went to, you know, even just go throw the old one in the, in the bin, I noticed, hey, what's this? This is like a foam insulation piece that wasn't on my new one, but does do a, a pretty good job of sealing it. It seals the door. So I had to take the door panel off again. And we'll just transfer it to the new one. And everything just it pushes on. Get that right through the right spot. And that will seal, because you need this here to seal the window, which would not be ideal. So we just push it all back down. Okay. There we go. Let's ready to put that in again. So we'll try it again, but uh, yeah, just keep in mind, learn from my mistakes, don't forget that. And like that, door panel back on for the second time, and we can unwrap it. There we go. A bit of dirt there, but we now have a mirror that's not held on by screws. 